work people. He's selling himself short. He's a very talented coach and has won everywhere he's been. Flanagan oh. drops a hammer. Bench. Yeah. It's powerful. See again, see all these dribbles without going anywhere? He's Flanagan buries it. It's a great shot. It's a great. Seven misses at the strike for Missouri. What a challenge tonight. It has gotten point lead for App State with the basketball. Quick hands and a steal by Cardwell. Ahead, Flanagan thunders at home. Well, if you do it right, it just causes rotations. They're running a horn, Horns offense that they're trying to get the Auburn's defense spread out and put them in a decision-making mode. Flanagan with a left hand. Good contest that time by Thor as he went up with Vanover. When you're 7-3, how do you allow your shot to be blocked? You have to ring the middle a lot better for this club. Baseline, that's his old fashioned flex. They mix it up. Here comes that running job. Yep. Nice handle. Just the power of the freshman nicely done. Pretty good. Let us just yeah. run it right away. That's just a shooter. Good pass by Cardwell, good effort by Flint. He's going to stay in, and he's going to defend Tyrell Jones. Let's see Cook up, though. Land again. He rejoins the play. Nice hesitation. hesitation. <laughs> it's a pleasure to get to meet him. Worked with his son, John Thompson the third for a couple of years. And uh, four incredible dynamos in the history of coaching. <laughs> So, so much for uh, recognizing the help there, but he doesn't make many mistakes, Drew. Back to back for Flanagan. Advantage for Gonzaga, four minutes in. I can see Wat Watson progressing too, though. Right here, a little blow by. Oh, Flanagan with the left. The late ability, yeah. toughness. It, it, it's demanding without demanding. Yep. Flanagan, it's outlet for Ayayi. The save, but to Flanagan. Here comes off. Nice maneuver around Watson. I really trust his instincts. Played a little bit of point guard in high school. He trusts his instincts. He knows, though, that this Jaguar team is going to stay in that zone. It was uh, interesting to hear Bruce Pearl said someday he's going to get paid to play. Now, you don't know where, but, I mean, someday he's going to be a pro. But he's had five. Flanagan from very long range. Wow. Liqueur out of Toronto knocking down the three-pointer and Richie Riley his enthusiasm is infectious and they do uh, you know talk to the Denver Broncos about that right all the yeah, quarterbacks yeah. had to be out because they weren't careful enough because it's a contact tracing thing and so that was a nifty move a Euro step I guess here comes Memphis on the run out Flanagan beautiful take by Reed. great zone here in Atlanta Flanagan with seven on the shot clock Flanagan Gonna go one on one in the trees. Got it. It's a drop. What a, but not a third. And read that stat. I remember you read that to me, Mike, and I was, I was very surprised. Holiday hoops giving in the ATL. Flanagan a strong take, and that's gonna be a goaltend. Or Southern swinging around the perimeter. Here's a drive from Alexander. He's denied inside by four. Powell. Outlet, Flanagan, Trey, yes. But it looks like Flanagan's running the show. You can play a good pick and pop game with Thor, but Flanagan decides to take it to the ring. Change. Over 34 attempts. He's only gone nine, nine times, so you want to be able to attack the rim. You, you have to have two parts to your... A two run and a 12-point lead. Shot clock down the three. Step back three, Flanagan, you betcha! And now they're running the flicks. Who's going to possess this possession? And fake Flanagan bumped. Lay up. And Who is this freshman? 26 against Memphis last weekend. And he finds his teammate Allen. Two second shot clock. Flanagan, one of the new. Powell hits Flanagan on up. They're decked out. That's not just like <laughs> Christmas tree and wreath. It's uh, the, the ornament budget in the Pearl household is, uh, is over.
Hitting is Adrian Delft, their leading scorer. Quick three on the other end by Allen. If he can have that kind of career, Bruce would be okay with that. Winyan wasn't a terrific scorer, but he did everything else so well. It off to Duhart on a three. I think I'd want Delph taking Delph. shots. Boy, that's a quick trigger. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Late ball screen inside 10 on the shot clock. Here it comes. And there goes Flanagan. <laughs> Powell right into the wall that is Vanover. Williams passes up his three, and we'll launch another one. Get used to seeing a seven-foot-three guy attempt threes. And he has attempted 28 now on the year, 29. Late in that half, he ended up in the first half with 16. Vanover, the seven-foot-three, Razorback gets out-rebounded. Night for Arkansas. Our Arkansas has only turned it over 10 times. They have 92 points on the board. See, that, that's the that's special numbers. Oh, wow. Oh. Allen put down. Bruce Pearl wants a speed job. Aggies turn it over. And here's Powell in transition. Went a lot. Flanagan. And Auburn, in a sense, fortunate to only be trailing by that number without a three pointer made. Flanagan will change it right there from the corner. Tigers running out of time. The runner. And it's good by Flanagan. Bishop. And I thought Orlando's pool was standing out of bounds. Flanagan, it's all net from the corner. Felt like they were going to just pick up where they left off last year, and it doesn't work that way. Flanagan makes it a one possession affair. 50. Start out tonight. The slight deficit. Flanagan attacking the runner. Let's hope that Auburn gets Justin Powell back soon. Yeah, that's a big deal. Flanagan jams it in. Four threes. I watched Bruce Pearl. He is going nuts or was going nuts on his team. Rim, and when you do that, you can you can move a little bit and get a charge. Started out the game, taking a breather right now for the Tigers on the sideline as he works back into game shape. Flanagan on the bounce and got since. The uh, three-pointer count is up to 47. Five or ten next year. 16 second-half points, 22 on the day for Cooper. And a Cambridge opposite for three. Cardwell, another possession. Flanagan. Got it! Tom Crean staple. Hard cuts away from the ball to the basket. We talked about Cooper being fun to watch. I think Wheeler's fun to watch for a guy his size. Head to the next level, and Auburn fans certainly don't want to hear this. They just got Cooper on the floor as Flanagan connects inside. The Talented freshman. I do think they've got to get better offensively. Oh, what a look. Right now it's against Flanagan and let the game take care of itself. Didn't win them, too. Made that three pointer in rhythm. Auto goes down, is square in the paint. Landing and launches a three and called. So be physical with that play. One on one. Flanagan lowered his shoulder. Good defense from Boston. Offensive on Mintz, who may have got that. Quick shot. Ball game, and they have made life very difficult for two and white. Ask you checking him right now. Flanagan left hand, tough a bad pass and a turnover. Four. Rises, misses. The tip is good. For and so you can't have these lengthy losing streaks. And, and Hawks have lost four out of five. So I'm curious to see if that starts to change course this evening. Just one of 16 from downtown. He'll feed Flanagan. And of course, he plays the tip plays. Very dangerous. Look at the jump and scoring the last couple of games. Deep from that three point line. Yeah. Thought about the three, gave it up instead, and they'll get another possession out of it. Okay, you got the ball stop, match up the shooter, find him, match up. It's too easy. And that's going to be a key moving forward, right? If teams try and take away Cooper, other guys have to pick up the scoring slack. And not one time, and I expect it, not one complaint. Not one feels sorry, not one anything from Frank other than I... The rest of the team is 0 for 7 mm. from outside the line. 
Wow. And the three. His hands on that ball in tight spaces, in traffic. Guys crowd his airspace. And it's all going to boil down to his jump shot and how physical of a during the game. And I'm really happy for T Tillman because he's had a tough few years in terms of just roller coaster. Through sophomores in the SEC's got to make a play for this Auburn team so they aren't so dependent on Cooper. In the paint, lefty. Teague still on Cooper. Inside hanging. Oh, yeah. Eight or more. So, I mean, they're not even playing close games. No, and I'll tell you what's fun right now. Every day John has been guarding Sheree in part because of his connection with Omar Cooper, who's now an NBA agent. Represent high octane game because Georgia loves to push it and score in a hurry And we know what Auburn does again in this building They want to get the tempo up try to score them in there to Cooper was the fact that he understands The difference of what referees and how they're calling the game Off the heel and a rebound to Jamal Johnson. Here's Auburn to push now On the run out That's will take it. Missed the layup 10 seconds left Seven-point deficit. Got to hurry. They'll take the two. Ole Miss, when it, you talk about NCAA tournament on the outside looking in, uh, most projections are that six. And trying to get to where that SEC is in the weak part of this 2-3 zone, but there's not been much movement of the ball or players in this possession. Flanagan contested three, and he banks it. Oh, and the follow and the flush for Romello White. The quick counter, Cooper finds it. <laughs> Never ending search. Yep. The kick out Flanagan for three. And it goes. Weeping motion is not what you really want to see in a jump shot or a free throw. And off the uh, flagrant foul, it's the free throws. And, and the lay in. This is just a tremendous defense by Romello White both times at the rim. That time he's. Another alley-oop. Long rebound. Flanagan. Beautiful. Yeah. It's the chemistry on the offense that you're looking for and searching for as Kentucky continues to work at it. as nice pass. Did Flanagan get away with scoop shot? No. And rebound tracked down by Johnson. Nice look. The no look. Stepping away, just giving him that shot a little bit. Now look for the drive. Shot clock winding down. Flat again. The floater bakes it in. To do in terms of attacking this. And I can tell you one thing. If you're just passing the ball back and forth and not challenge anybody, it's not going to work. There you go. That one in the second half. Cooper against Askew. Cross. Switch. Lob it up to Flanagan. Using the weights that come from beyond the arc. Working it inside. Cooper has it blocked. Retrieves it. Flanagan will try. The set here would tend to shoot. Cooper makes his move. Good look. Extra feed. Ball is popping. Jump shot. Ake. Good deflection on the hands to throw the offense off. It is a steal. Mince turns it over. Flanagan. Straight line to the rim. We're top. And the building's got some sort of energy in it today with folks expecting a high level of offense. Here's Alan Flanagan. He'll launch from three. They bring a double to the post, dribbled out of there, and that will leave an opportunity for a drive, and he uses it. Flanagan, and he's rolling. Georgetown native, uh, Georgetown transfer, I should say, from Baton Rouge. Here's Flanagan now, the um, W, but, um, you know, no... Nobody had been through anything like that. So why would there need to be a rule in place going in? Now we've all lived a little for better and for worse. Which is crazy, too. Think about, I mean, Michigan State. Now that would be a little more legit if they get stuck as a, they get inserted as a two-seed, whoever that two-seed is. Flanagan off the bounce. And the team accustomed to getting the ball inside. Whether it's uh, entry pass or off the bounce, just four paint points, triples here in the first half. That's what's keeping a minute right now. Flanagan, another offensive rebound. Second chance. Bring go isolate on the wing. They tend to do that out of timeouts or when you really need a hoop, but you may want to play through him more. 
Just outside of him and Johnson, really not getting much offensively. Off the drive, Flanagan! Points for Auburn, that's the difference maker. Flanagan, three, got it! So look at this health if you're an Auburn Tiger. I mean, you see all that back. He's 19 and 6, 14 and 2 overall. It just has the offensive firepower to do that and the defensive intensity. Auburn just seems out of sync on offense right now. That's another sin. <laughs> Behind the curtain. <laughs> Backstage passes, and uh, you know, you can't keep every really hard to do. Yeah, isolation that's all really Flanagan nice. right there. Shot clock to five. Flanagan feeling it from death. both have to guard out on the perimeter. Johnson with five, drive and kick sets up Flanagan. He got it.